Hello boys and girls, welcome to Let's Play LA Noir. I know Rockstar Games, the company who made this game, from uh, Grand Theft Auto 3, which I have played on the PlayStation. I have enjoyed the game very much, uh, but I only played it for a week or so. Uh, this game, when I saw the trailer of it, and I saw the, the acting and the faces, uh, facial expressions uh, of, of the, of the uh, person here in, in, this, in this game, or the people, I thought, this is amazingly done, this is a breakthrough a milestone in game design, because it looks so natural, so realistic. No, there is no game like L.A. Noir which would or do it in uh, uh, with with that professionality. I don't know how how they did it. They must have recorded live actors and then mapped, tracked their movements and then mapped them on uh, 3D virtual 3D models and uh, something like that must have happened. But this is amazingly realistic. I love it. And that's that's why I, I play this game. It's also uh, reminiscent of the Grand Theft Auto 3 story. But this time we are on the good side. We are the policemen, we are the cops, the detectives, investigators. And we fight crimes rather than commit them. Um, I've, I'm doing it not as a blind let's play. Not as a totally blind let's play. I have b bad experience with Skyrim. I was quite clumsy there at the beginning. I've tried to record this as a blind let's play from the very beginning, my very first moments of the game. And when I watched it, I was desperate. It, w it was it was unwatchable because I was so uh, uh, so confused about everything um, that I decided no. Just go through the tutorial and when you are familiar enough, start recording. So this is where we start. I'm starting a new game um, and enjoy the introduction. Um, I won't comment it at all during uh, the introduction. Just fully concentrate on it and enjoy the nice realistic acting of the people there. A city on the verge of greatness. A new type of city, based not on the man, but on the automobile, the car, the symbol of freedom and vitality. Where every man can own his own home and have room to breathe and not be overlooked by his neighbors. A city where a man's home is his castle quarter acre of the dream made possible by victory. The city of opportunists. The city of dreams, where Hollywood will shape the thoughts and desires of the entire planet. The city of pioneers. century city that will become a model for the world. A city that has no boundaries, that will stretch as far as the eye can see. In the Marine Corps, you deal with the chain of command. Mistakes get made, but you deal with them. 
You know what you're fighting for and that you're on the same team. But dealing with corruption is like chasing shadows. You never know whether the guy you're talking to is on the pad, or whether it's your partner, or maybe even the watch commander. So who do you trust, Cole? I made up my mind a long time ago. KGBL calling car. Hmm, who do we trust? Adam, Go ahead, KGPL. Fourteen Adam, see the detective an ambulance shooting at Sixth and Industrial Street. Get a sixteen William request uniform assistance for an evidence search. Fourteen Adam, go to. Roger, fourteen Adam en route. Here we go again. They don't request uniforms for an evidence search unless there's some kind of catch. Ever the opposite. From the beam of sunshine himself. Floyd Rose, homicide. You might back up? Yes, sir. Phelps and Dunn, Wilshire Division. We had a shooting took place down this alleyway. We have the Vic, Scooter Payton, a Negro male bagged up and on his way to Central Morgue. Witness says a tall white guy, our shooter, put two in the Vic's head and then threw his piece. I need you guys to try and recover the gat. You want us to look anywhere in particular? Give it your best shot, guys. The dead guy's a low life. I'm not expecting any miracles here. And if we recover the weapon? Bag it and return it to technical services. You hurry it up, Floyd. We I'm got out of here. To be. Happy hunting. Hmm. So, as you might feel, there, this is, is, a fist hump. there is something wrong about this motion. Floyd. Probably right. Um, just get it over and done. All right, have it your way. It we'll search right converts. Uh, uh, if you still don't come uh, up with anything, come find me and we'll talk it out. You have the Two feeling that, that he, he is trying to uh, conceal something. Uh, he's, he may be involved in this case and... Um, look at this junk. Yeah. Let's look at this. Not my job to pick through other people's Incidental. trash. Mm. Yeah. I like how you can observe objects here. What sure have you this got, Belt? No, this doesn't mean anything here. Jeez. Now I want to escape here. Okay. I have my troubles with my left-handed mouse. There is no way of redefining the mouse button properly here. And um, so I actually have to right click everywhere. I tell you I'm jinxed. I always get landed with this crap. But look at this. Yeah, blood stain. Shooter put him up against the wall and blew his brains out. Hmm. Hell of a way to go. Yeah. Certainly. Doesn't really matter how you go once you're gone. <laughs> Don't get all deep on me, Phelps. Mm hmm. And then it's a, that window is f flashing up. I I was actually looking quite a long time in my first playthrough how to get in We're there. We're never gonna find it. It's a waste I, of time. I, I thought this is a door or somewhere must be a door, and I wanted to see that room. Oh look, it's actually Ralph. There's something on the rooftop. How the hell did you see that? I didn't Reflection notice that you can look on the window. Looks like it might be our weapon. I'm gonna see if I can find a way up there. All right, don't hurt yourself. Of course. Exit inspection. So now this way, this way we. The gun's up on the roof, right? Yes, it's so on the roof. We need to find a way up. Ah, uh, we can climb this. And by looking, you, you see all sorts of places. What it's kind here. of chumps do these homicide guys think we are? Hmm. And here we see manipulate objects. Smith and Wesson, serial hmm. S71893. All right, and further investigate. Uh, we see two rounds. Two rounds fired. fired. Instead of dropping it down a drain, our shooter hoists it up here. Interesting guy. Hmm, really. Okay. We should Nothing follow up else? on this now, before the perp tries to leave town. Nothing else to look at here, I guess. 
but yes, let's see. We have the gun, Cole. Let's take it back to Central. We could get a commendation. We could show some initiative, Ralph, and see if we can come up with an owner. That's a long shot, Cole. It's a pretty fancy gun. You know a local gun store? Sure. There's a place a couple of blocks from here. Let's go there. Are you sure about this? It's not really our gig. Yeah, come. No harm in doing some digging. The suits didn't seem to give much of a damn. Such a little boy scout, Cole. You can't wait to get out of that uniform, can you? <laughs> You'd rather round up drunks and help old ladies across the road? I'd rather get through the day without the captain's foot up my ass. It'll be fine, Ralph. You worry too much. Yeah, so he also suspects some something uncanny here, probably. So we we go to the wait gun store. Set as destination. Quite far away. It's not at all local. Should be here somewhere. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like these ducks. Officers Phelps and Dunn. Can you tell us anything about this gun? Smith and Wesson, Model 27, registered Magnum. Chambered for 357, nickel plated with pearl grips. Same gun used by General Patton. <laughs> You're not General suggesting Patton. he's the owner. No, I'm not. You seem to know a lot about the weapon. I ought to. I sold it. You know this piece will stop a rhino. These babies are only available special order. Here's my Smith and Wesson order book. You mind if I take a look? Be my guest. Mm -hmm. This is about something bad, right? Open. Model 27 with pearl grips, Cole. You see it on there? Model 27. This one has a walnut grip. Model 27 with a pearl grip. This is it. We're in luck. Errol Schroeder. 203 South Glass Street. Ordered the gun in February 46. Mm -hmm. Thanks, you've been a big help. Anytime. Always happy to help out the LAPD. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's visit. Can we call it in. Let's see if he's at home. Yeah, let's see. If Only the gun doesn't prove he pulled the trigger. Okay. In for a penny, in for a pound. Lead the way, Gunga Den. I don't know whether we should fly with the siren when we are fly when we are uh, uh, drive with the siren when we are driving to an apartment of a suspect. Of course, arriving there with a no, siren so hard, would inform him, right? Because we're in uniform doesn't mean we can't use our initiative. I guess so. Seems a little too good to be true. One of a kind murder weapon bought locally using a real name. Mm. If Schroeder's our shooter, 
He's no criminal mastermind. Yeah. Most of them aren't. That's why they get caught. And two out of every three crimes are done on impulse. Another fact from the Phelps Encyclopedia of Thin Air. You really are full of them. I tend to press shift for the car to make it run faster like a horse in Skyrim, you know, but it doesn't work. Out of the way, cars! Sorry, 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 I'm not familiar with the drive, uh, driving yet. So here it is. Let's have a look at here. Schroeder. Schroeder. Apartment 2. Apartment 2, okay. Let's go to apartment 2. They did also the stair walking animations quite right. Each stair matches each step, not like in Skyrim. What do you guys want? I'm Officer Cole Phelps. This is Officer Dunn, Wilshire Division. You're the owner of a Smith & Wesson Model 27, nickel-plated with pearl grips? I might be. What of it? Then you'll be surprised to know that Scooter Payton was murdered tonight with your gun. You're out of your mind. Scooter, he works for me. I have that gun here in my drawer. What the fuck is going on here? You're under arrest, Schroeder. Cuff him, Ralph. No way. You're not taking me down for this. That was a very bad move. <laughs> you ready? Ouch. Oh, I'm not holding the other mouse button. So... Ralph, you alright? I'm fine, I hardly felt it. He's lucky he caught me off guard. Keep an eye on him, Ralph. I'm gonna take a look around. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's see in that drawer where he had that gun. Oh, but here. Ah, uh, nothing important, right? I just didn't explore it yet. It's the usual mess. This is important. This notebook. Artie Rosenberg, September 4th, 46, 50, summers, 20, 40. This is a payroll. And look here, Floyd Rose. His name's in a series of numbers. Floyd Rose's name is in this book. That's the detective. Phelps, we can come out of this all bright and shiny with a commendation, or stick our schlongs in a hornet's nest. Call it in, partner, and leave the book where you found it. Officer Phelps, badge twelve forty-seven. Requesting. Yeah. That's strange, isn't it? So we found out that there is something going on. The, the 
police is corrupted or at least our uh, our bosses are or at least Floyd Ross is and these flashbacks I don't know what they what role they play it's probably some memories of uh, wartime how we spent the wartime you dumb fucking sons of bitches get in this line now before I lose my temper excuse me sergeant but excuse me fuck you you say another word and I'll break your fucking head and have you in the brig some of us are here for I know why you're here ass wipe I'm having a bad day private some people don't seem to want to get on this bus didn't ask for your help he didn't ask for your help can you believe this guy who are you two, Abbott and Costello? We're here for OCS, Sergeant. So it's the three fucking stooges and you're here for OCS. God help this fucking country in the USMC. The Japanese will do the world a favor and kill you quickly. All three of you are on report. What are your fucking names? Phelps. Kelso. Merrill. Any other gentlemen for OCS? OCS is at Elliot. You take the Camp Elliot bus over there. This bus is for MCRD. This bus is for men who want to fight. I don't know what MCRD or OCS is, uh, but probably we took the bus, which doesn't lead to the right place, Cole. A city that needed an honest battle with thirsty the men direct water. battle it with the Japanese. Story, but you weren't interested. You were here to fight the good fight, solve yes. cases, right wrongs. The force is like politics. There's no sitting on the fence. You have to choose sides. No sitting on the fence. A brown paper envelope or a Greyhound ticket to Palookaville. It could only ever end. All units to 211 in progress and shots fired at Westlake Savings and Loan. 1415 West 3rd Street. Unit to handle identified code 3. We'll take that. It's only a couple blocks from 14 here. Adam calling KGPL. We'll handle the 211. Roger that, 14 Adam. Be advised suspects are armed and dangerous. Armed and dangerous. Oh, I hate these missions. I'm, I so suck at fights and, and shooting. Mm. But we have to go through. the trunk to achieve the weapon. Okay, how do I aim? What's shooting? Aiming is this one. Aiming and reload. I never had to reload in my first playthrough. Target. Oh, I can't move when I'm targeting. Why can't I move when I'm targeting? Ah! Find some cover. Try for the front door. Keep your goddamn head down. Use the cover, Phelps. What is the cover? Uh, we don't know how many are in there. Take it slow. I don't understand the the Back meaning. Oh, soon. not the meaning, but the LAPD. How, put down your weapon. How a cover the works? If, 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 if there is I'm a shooting. Stay in uh, I understand that I can cover behind this. Stay down. Reload. Okay. What's oh, just? There we go. That's it. We got them all. Really? I think we got them, Cole. Should be all clear. Okay. Wow. That was horrible. Lieutenant Hopkins says anytime you. No, but I I don't understand. End up you see this this so cover. I, I understand okay, you can hide be, well, behind an obstacle. Glad you have my back. 
Man but couldn't ask for a better partner. Shooting to cover somebody? I don't know how it works. Completely uh, uninformed, unexperienced about this. This kind of opportunity comes along once in a lifetime, Hank. <laughs> I have to grasp it. You have to survive at first, Cole. Here are the veterans. The Japs love to shoot officers. If I can make a name for myself in this war, my future... Thinking of taking on a company of the Emperor's finest single-handed? You don't seem the Sergeant York type to me. When I need your opinion, Kelso, I'll ask for it. They talk about officers like you in boot camp, Cole. They call it the Custer Syndrome. Guys who go around dreaming of fame and glory and getting all of their men killed in the process. Our duty is to lead, Kelso. And their duty is to die for your wonderful future? <laughs> this custer must, must, of course, refer, I think, to the uh, custer in Cold the films, battle of Kelso. Little Big Horn. With some people, it's as simple as chemistry. Two guys who should have been friends, but their personalities got in the way. Mm. Phelps, a good guy, wound way too tight. Kelso. And Kelso, a quiet man who could never walk away from a fight. Mm. Well, it's a shame you don't like to talk about it, Cole. Ralph, friends who want to stay friends don't discuss religion or politics. And in my case, you can add the war to that. I know that bomb. Wendell Bowers. I put him away before he jumped parole. Get after him, Phelps. I'll head him off in the car. Wendell Bowers, stop! LSD! I don't know exactly mean what what does it mean to jump parole. But obviously, he did something wrong and escaped. Power! Hold it right there! Stop now or I will shoot! I won't tell you again, Wendell! Jesus, gun! Watch your fire! Don't want to do this, Wendell! Get down from there right now! Give it up, Wendell! Stay the hell away from me! Ah! You gotta be kidding! You fucking ask for it! <laughs> no way I'm going back inside! I've done my time! Ah! You assholes already screwed me one! It's over, Bowers! Run Give it up, it. Bowers! There's nowhere left to go! Ah! Looks like we've got the place to ourselves. So, he's knocked out, so what? Now What you doing, Wendell? Your parole officer's feeling lonely. He's got a hole in his life for an asshole like you. You can make it up to him in ten years' time. Watch your head. This hump will be back in the Iron Hotel by tomorrow night. Nice work, Cole. You run track in high school? I also don't know what does it mean to run track in high school or run track. Uh, Part of the tradition of the Marine Corps and being an officer in the Marine Corps is the ability to make tough decisions. The right decision is not always the popular one. The right decision will get the men you care about killed. These ratings and your ability to give them frankly and truthfully directly affect your chances of successfully becoming a Marine officer. Candidate Phelps, you have the floor. Esprit de corps, Merrill, 10, Franklin, 8, Weiss, 8, Donahoe, 6, Kowalski, 6, Hudson, 5, Kelso, 2, Leadership, Donahoe, 8, Franklin, 7, Merrill, 6, Kowalski, 6, Weiss, 5, Hudson, 5, Kelso, 1. Candidate Kelso! 
I'm sorry, Captain, but I joined the Marine Corps to fight the enemy, not get involved in this schoolboy chicken shit. Kelso, in my office, now! Oh, you he had to. Mm. It, it's like For every cop, giving there's the case grades or marks to gives you that leg up, gets you recognized as the shining new star in the squad. Friends there. The case that you solve that shows that you have the gumption, the gung ho, the get up and go to make you stand out from your average rank and file patrolman. Mm -hmm. This could be the one goal. Ah. LAPD, could you stand clear of the body, please? Has anyone called an ambulance? We've called.